essentially I'm a structural biologist, I will start with that. And what we're doing in the lab is really to try and understand how we see three-dimensional structures, how they function and how we relate them into a real actual biological content. The main challenges for me to start a new lab, I would say it was mainly not the scientific part as much as the you accept the role of being a mentor. And now you need to be the leader of your group, you need to be the one that helps them to advance, to become a, a, a more scientific person. We are a special lab, that's uh, first of all, we're very loud, uh, even in the Israeli terms, uh, which is uh, make a big difference. But what I'm, I'm looking personally is the spark. I want someone that is really into science, someone that have the thinking, have the ideas, take the risks. I'm always considered that as the red button. I want him to see without fear pressing the red button, although something can explode. For combining the family life plus the uh, uh, scientific life, for me somehow it's, uh, it was more natural. Um, I tend not to work for very strange hours. It was always like that. I always decided from the PhD level that it's okay to finish on five if you're very efficient. So the idea is that to finish all you can and then go home and see what you can do.